So today we're doing the jerky gauntlet where we review 10 different types of jerky ranging from earthworm to emu to hammerhead shark. And some of these look really pretty disgusting. The earthworm, I don't know. Which one do you think is going to be the worst? The earthworm, yeah. The Moroccan octopus might be pretty bad too. <laughs> so what do you want to start with? Uh, let's go down the line, I guess. We'll go with the easy first? Yeah. The New England clam strip jerky. It smells fishy. Yeah. One quick fact about jerky. In the past year, $1.5 billion worth of jerky has been sold in the US and sales have gone up 13% since 2013 and 46% since 2009. Yeah, it has a very fishy odor. A little bit of black pepper. Mm-hmm. Kind of a sweet taste to it. Practice the teriyaki sauce in there. Very rough texture. Mm-hmm. I don't know how they get strips this long on uh, clams. They must have chopped and formed them. <laughs> kind of grainy. Mm-hmm. Sweet and fishy at the same time. You like that? No. It has the texture of like a raisin. I'm not a fan of the first one. <laughs> no. All right, what, what do we got next? Emu. It smells weird. It does smell a little weird. Kind of, sm kind of smoky. Much softer than the clam. Mm -hmm. Have you ever eaten emu before? No. <laughs> Has a good beef jerky taste to it. Smoky and a bit sweet as always. Reminds me a little bit of original Jack Link's. Yeah. I think there's something to compare the taste to them. Checklings teriyaki style. Yeah, that's what it tastes like. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if all of them have teriyaki sauce, but but most of them do, I know. That was the one bummer of most of these, is that I think except for the earthworm, they all have teriyaki sauce and wheat in them. Except for the earthworm jerky, and they're all from the Newport Jerky Company. And that was just coincidence as we were looking up different types. If you want to recreate this gauntlet with your family, you can get all these on Amazon.com. Um, they all range in about the $14 to $18 range. So yeah. none of them are cheap, but uh, they're all on Amazon. You also can go to NewportJerkyCompany.com to find them. Thoughts on Emu? It's good. It tastes like teriyaki. It tastes like regular beef jerky, actually. That wasn't anything out of the ordinary. Next up we have swordfish. It smells like the ocean. This one's very hard again, like the clam. I think I like this better than the emu. Glad we lifted weights yesterday. Mm -hmm. There's protein bomb. I thought it was fishy and fruity with a hint of oranges. For me it's like real leathery. The flavor's not bad. Very tough to chew. It's pretty good. Not quite as good as the emu. No. The first use for jerky was when Native Americans took it on their long journeys as protein food. All right, jerky, what do we have next? <laughs> Alpaca. Jerky looks real fatty. You can see chunks of yeah. fat in the chunks. The marbling. The marbling is fantastic on this jerky. Very hard. The fat on it gives a real creamy taste. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's sweet enough. This almost tastes like like dessert jerky. It almost has like a creamy like sugar cookie type taste. Like pixie sticks jerky. So far for me, way too sweet on mm -hmm. all, these, all these. Kind of tastes like a really old pastry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like if you just like left the donut out for like a week. How's <laughs> oh, that for a selling point? <laughs> Newport Jerky Company will not be hiring us anytime soon. <laughs> Especially for advertising for them. <laughs> like to advertise your alpaca jerky. It tastes like an old donut. <laughs> <laughs> Cleansing the palate. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next on the docket, kangaroo jerky. We had done a exotic meat gauntlet with a lot of different meats. We try not to have any of them repeat. This is one of the best ones for me. Yeah. I really like this one. Soft and it's not overly sweet. I give a big thumbs up to the kangaroo mm -hmm. jerky. <laughs> Hair is overrated. Don't believe me? I got four names for you. Vin Diesel, Jason Strahan, Michael Jordan, and who do you else do you think of when you hear those names? 
Crew Brother J, that's right. <laughs> Jerky was invented around 1550 by the Quechua people, which was a tribe in South America, and they call it Sharky, which meant dried meat. All right, what's next? Halfway through. Snapping turtle. Very peppery. Yeah, major black pepper. It tastes like um the beef jerky variety of peppered. Just the ones that real heavily black peppered? Yeah. Yeah, it was overwhelmingly black pepper. The jerky as a whole reminds me of this brand of jerky called Alien Fresh Jerky. And it's one you can buy, I think, Cal I know it's in California. I've seen it on road trips and in Arizona, like a roadside jerky shop. Um, but I was not a massive fan of that. If you like sweet, to, to be said on these too, if you like sweeter jerky, you probably love these as a whole. Um, I'm just not a fan when it's, when it's extra sweet, but Alien Fresh was like that. Yeah, I remember they had that one jerky called Weed Killer Hot. Oh yeah, Weed Killer, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really appetizing flavor. All right, the one I'm dreading the most, Earthworm Jerky. And this one's actually made by Thailand Unique. Isn't this the company, this is the same company that made the Tarantula, right? And the scorpions that we had in the tarantula scorpion smoothie? Um, I think. Ooh, that looks like like leathery rattlesnake goodness. <laughs> goodness. <laughs> goodness with a, a, a slight sarcastic hint. Like if you'd like carve off some, some shavings off the mummy display yeah. at the local museum, that's probably. Oh. Feels sticky. All right. Into the earthworm. Mm. Oh, that's nasty. That's really nasty. It tastes like dirt. Mm-hmm. Oh. It kind of burned at the beginning. Oh, that is so gross. And when the saliva starts building in your mouth, it's worse. This was their breakfast bacon. It's like I'm chewing a used bandage in the middle of Egypt in a sandstorm, <laughs> and the bandage still has some flesh on it. <laughs> Grainy. It just... <laughs> used bandage, gauze, dirt, foul filth. Back into the earth with you. That was about five minutes of chewing. It's like, it, it was like burnt grass, and it took me five minutes of chewing. Yeah. <laughs> would you? How would you? Would you put that in the top five worst things you've ever had in your life? Yeah. I mean, too. Probably the uh, fourth or third thing worst thing I ever had. It'd be way up there for me. Oh, that was. Vegemite is my second worst, and um, cod liver oil is the the worst. That might have been my worst of all time. That was that was terrible. You could taste yeah. the sand. <laughs> All right, next. All right. Hammerhead shark. And the fishy ones, I like it more than the clam. It tastes like rosemary. Overly sweet. So, I mean, the subtleties of the shark taste, I think would be quite a bit better. It wasn't an overwhelming yeah. sugar and brown sugar. J jerky's not supposed to be sweet. No, the best jerky, I like the ones like Dukes. Yeah. But they don't add any sugar. Or Alberto. Alberto's pretty good. Where they generally go all natural. All right, next one. Right. Last two. Ostrich jerky. <laughs> tough to chew? Yeah, this one's very tough to chew. Like scratching my mouth is a straight past it. You know, makes really good jerky. Uh, US Wellness Meats makes very good grass fed jerky. Uh, so does, uh, they make really good pemmican. That's, that's very good. And um, there's a company called Epic that makes very good different varieties. Uncured bacon jerky. Mm -hmm. It's tough, but it's good. Mm -hmm. You like this one? Yeah, because one of the ones where it doesn't taste sweet, it tastes like normal beef jerky. Yeah, it's got a little bit of sweetness, but it's not overly, overly sweet. Of course, we're a fan of fun intros. One of the best intros of all time is on Cowboy Bebop, which is an awesome anime series. So if you haven't checked that out, it's, it's pretty cool. And it's got an intro that James Bond would be proud of. You remember that one, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, final protein slab. What, what you got for me? 
Moroccan octopus. <clears throat> kind of looks like bacon. My octopus bacon in the morning. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Some little tentacles My on it. My strip, yeah. Ouch. <laughs> it's like snake skin. Flavor's not bad. Um, just really, really rough. All right, Moroccan octopus. Tastes like spicy smoked fish. Okay. You know, it's like for me, it's like octopus fruit roll up is mm. the, the texture. But harder to chew. All right, Jerky Gauntlet. Overall thoughts, what are your favorites, least favorite? Favorite is kangaroo, my least favorite is earthworm. Okay, and mine is exactly the same. The kangaroo was the best, and earthworm. <laughs> earthworm was terrible. Um, though, in a video coming up, <laughs> if you think the earthworm was bad, we got something coming up in an upcoming video that might make the earthworm taste like birthday cake. <laughs> it's gonna be so bad, so stay tuned. We also have a couple of fun collabs coming up and a lot of other fun surprises later this year. Thanks so much for all the support, we love you. Thanks always for watching and see you guys later.